Well, I was challenged at SAR to think in new ways. Um, I came in with a cohort of scholars and artists um, who had varied backgrounds um, and whose own work challenged me to think about my own work in different ways. So it's, was in very, it was a very enriching um, and informing and challenging time here at SAR for me um, academically. But in the end, it, uh, it, it helped me kind of think of new ways of, of, of looking at my own work. SAR continues to be a place where scholars across disciplines can gather and exchange ideas. Um, this includes artists, um, where artists can gather and exchange um, ideas and disseminate those ideas to people across the world, across disciplines. And I think that's where SAR kind of has its biggest impacts. While here, I um, adopted the use of uh, drone technology in my work. So I've kind of inverted the practice of archeology span by um, using drones, capturing data from above rather than groundbreaking and excavating and taking data from, from the ground. So in, in that way, I guess it's ground, groundbreaking. I'd like to say thank you uh, for your support. Um, your support has allowed me to be a part of the SAR community. Um, it's also allowed um, generations and future generations of scholars and native peoples and communities uh, to engage and be a part of SAR's community as well.